Hey everybody, welcome back. Today, like one of my favorite, favorite days when I go to the mailbox and there's that great big ass box from Battle Box. This one is extra special in, in two ways. This is Mission 34, B.O.B. Box, Bug Out Bag, or Best of Battle Box. Uh, if you are not signed up for Battle Box, uh, it is a monthly subscription based uh, home delivery service, and you have uh, four different tiers basic, advanced, pro, and pro plus. And with each of those boxes, you get various items. As you step up to from the basic to the advanced, you'll get everything in the basic plus the advanced and so forth moving forward. Uh, if you really like what you see here, because with Battle Box, it's, it's not easy because they go through them so fast to, to necessarily go back and get something that you've previously seen. This one, Mission 34, moving forward, is also going to be their welcome box. So if you were to sign up next month, this is the box that you're going to get. If you sign up in three months, this is the first box that you get. They'll always start you with this one. At least until they change it. Uh, since I have been involved with BattleBox, I know that this is... This is the third one, so you know they they like to they like to mix it up. They don't want to keep say the same one going going forever. So they basically run one of their welcome boxes for basically it's a year. So thirty four bug out bag. Okay, we'll start with the uh, basic. If you were to only sign up for the basic, you're going to pay twenty four ninety nine. Uh, this month it has a fifty one fifty one dollar and forty six uh, sent uh, value. The first thing that you're going to get is the Mini Inferno. Uh, you'll probably recognize this. This one has been uh, uh, in uh, previous ones, but it's a, a fire, a fire starting aid. So it's something that you're you're going to want to have in your bug out bag, you know, maybe even in the glove compartment of your vehicle, a tackle box, whatever. You uh, break off, uh, you can either use the whole wafer or break off uh, little pieces of this, and this will really uh, aid you in uh, being able to get uh, your, your fire going. That's the Mini Inferno, uh, $8 uh, for that item. Next, the uh, Backpacker's Pantry. Uh, I have uh, I've actually seen quite a bit of stuff from them. I believe uh, locally there's a couple of places that sell their stuff. I have yet to try any of it. And uh, normally you guys know when it comes to the battle box, I may not be the first person to ever put up a, a battle box video because I don't like this particular delivery service, battle box that is, to be a mystery. I like to look through the stuff, if I can use the stuff, but something like this, I mean, I know it's add water, you know, wait and eat, so I don't, I don't want to just uh, uh, waste it being able to tell you that it's good. I actually want to be able to put this into the bug out bag, so I have Obviously, I have not made it, but it's one of those things that uh, you uh, tear the top. It has a, a Ziploc uh, enclosure on it. You read the directions. basically tells you to add two and a half cups of uh, boiling water. Stir well, seal, and you uh, let it sit for 15 or 20 minutes at uh, 5,000 5, feet of elevation. And every 5,000 feet you go up you basically double the amount of time. So, back Packers Pantry, Louisiana Red Beans and Rice. Now, you know, if you were out, say, camping and you, uh, you know, you shot a rabbit or, I mean, I'm not saying I'm into, like, squirrel and stuff like that. I understand some of you say it's a delicacy, but, uh, you know, you could maybe uh, cook up the meat and then uh, add the meat uh, to it so you could De definitely create uh, a meal. Next, the Battle Box flashlight. Uh, 
BattleBox Tactical Flashlight. Requires one AA or you can use a 1450 rechargeable battery not included. Now, I can tell you I can tell you that this is a nifty little light because a while back I uh, I won a contest uh, being hosted by uh, SpecOp56 so you can see I have one and I have been using it I actually have it sitting down here on the uh, on the uh, the desk it it's a it's definitely a cool little light it's definitely a bright little light and the one thing that's neat about it is you can adjust the focus point for the size of the beam from a really uh, direct to a full-on flood it also uh, you can like momentarily touch it and you'll get uh, high low and the strobe effect and this has a uh, value of ten dollars what I like about it is it works good and it's running on uh, a fairly easy easy battery just their traditional double A so that is the battle box tactical flashlight let's just do this next in the basic uh, survival frog tac bivy again I uh, ever have one of those things where once you take it out of the uh, uh, the the bag you you can just never get it back in here this is uh, this is another thing and a bug out bag especially this time of the year where I am where right now it is 18 degrees this is basically a uh, wind and waterproof and it reflects a uh, 90% of your body heat and it's it's a uh, it's it's like a uh, uh, a sleeping bag you know you can uh, crawl into it uh, zip it up stay warm emergency shelter you know uh, you get stuck in the middle of nowhere in your car again fairly small size yet when you need it to be uh, body sized and this is a uh, a twenty dollar uh, value definitely a better way of going than say those old emergency blankets that look like you're wearing uh, aluminum foil or maybe you're gonna make your alien uh, alien wear uh, thought saver uh, so definitely and also reusable you know because they're fairly thin you know even if you get one use and it saves you it's done its job next is the uh, water drop high purity water filter again I have not used these but I did some uh, I have done some research on it and these things absolutely look uh, cool as hell orange flavor what this is is a packet there you go it looks looks like nothing you drop this into just about any uh, water you could throw this in a mud puddle and it can take uh, up to eight hours through osmosis to uh, absorb and filter the water through into the packet the purifying uh, uh, material in uh, inside is an orange flavor so you will find this all full puffed up like that like a great big old uh, uh, juice juice bag and then they have the straw and you just uh, uh, puncture it and use the straw to uh, drink the liquid from inside again I haven't used one because I've watched uh, I've watched and done some research on these they uh, they seem to work awesome I didn't want to waste one something else that will go into the uh, bug out bag in case it is uh, needed so you're able to create 
water from just about anything. Now a couple of a couple of gross thoughts went through my mind as far as you know what if the only water source you have is a used toilet? That that I don't know. But they say you know you drop it in a in a river or a, a pond or a puddle, like even a mud puddle. So that's the uh, water drop uh, filter pouches. And that winds up the basic. That's that's what you would get right here for your twenty four ninety nine. Now we step up to the advanced, which means this is going to be in the box plus this particular month two items: the battle box uh, camp uh, bottle set, a thirty dollar value. Definitely something else I want to uh, add to the. Uh, bug out or or camp pack of course you get the uh, mesh carrying container the uh, small pot or could be used as a an oversized cup Got the uh, fold out handles on it. Does have, uh, if you need a, a particular amount uh, to it. And then it also comes with, if you say you build uh, something and you're, you want to uh, hang it up over, uh, over your fire. Like that, and then you can uh, you can hang it. If you're making something in particular uh, that you uh, you need to strain, the cover also will work as a as a strainer. And the canteen. Next in the advanced is the uh, Exotac uh, Poly Striker. Uh, something else that I have had a uh, a few of these over the years. Everything is all uh, contained in one. Let's see, uh, up to a thousand strikes per rod. And between uh, that and the uh, mini infernos, uh, you would be uh, on your way to uh, starting, starting a campfire. That's the advanced. Now we step up to the pro. That is a hundred dollars. Make a little room here. First item in there is the 72 hour uh, bug out bag and this this is a absolutely awesome bag there is so many compartments you can cinch cinch it up you can open it up to get the uh, the full the full size out of it it has the molly webbing uh, someplace that you can uh, uh, stick one of your one of your patches or something on it. Well, uh, has a big front pocket. This opens up, giving you uh, uh, again the whole depth of the bag, plus a. Uh, a liner you maybe put maps or something in in this front compartment flip it over here to gain access to the to the inside again put 
put things in here. You know, the uh, I got the uh, the single man uh, battle box uh, tent that would fit in here. It has another compartment uh, that you could put something like a, a laptop or your tablet or something right there. That's all the uh, inside. Now. I got the uh, carry handle on it that's removable and then you notice the the whole back zips open and now you can uh, roll that up to get it out of your way have yourself you can turn it into a, from a carried case into a uh, into a backpack it has the nice uh, padding on it to help uh, uh, make sure that your back isn't going to get sore it's also going to help uh, wick uh, perspiration away from you nice 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 bag very nice bag this guy has a uh, seventy dollar value. Next would be the fish trap. Probably, in all honesty, the one thing that I probably would uh, would not use. Not, I'm, I'm honestly just not a huge fish fan but it uh, folds open pops open and becomes a uh, a live a live fish trap uh, you would be could use it for uh, catching your dinner you could use it for catching uh, smaller fish that you would then use for catching bigger fish but that is the fish trap that is a uh, fifteen dollars and that is the pro level Next is the Pro Plus, and the Pro Plus always puts you into the, ni the Knife of the Month Club. And this month, I can, uh, I can honestly say if you are a knife person, you will not be disappointed this month. Uh, this is the second uh, offering from BattleBox with a knife from Tops, Tops Knives. Uh, the first one was their uh, the Cub, and all of the fixed blade knives that I have, the my three favorite knives have all come from BattleBox: the uh, Gerber LMF, the Tops Cub, and now the Tops uh, Bushcraft Fieldcraft knife. This one is an exclusive uh, color to Battle Box. Now you you may even look at it and go, okay, maybe you've caught another. Uh, You've caught another uh, video out there on Mission 34 and you say, mine looks different. Well, they ship it with uh, basically an unfinished micarta. And I uh, used a, a light uh, reddish brown stain and then I put some uh, butcher block, knife butcher block, uh, sealant on it. Kind of the same thing I've done with uh, some of the other uh, kit knives. Like this is a this was a bush bushcraft knife uh, from uh, from Battle Box. The first thing that you're going to notice on this knife, and like I said, and I'm and I openly say it, 
I, overall, am not a knife guy. I know when I see a knife that I really like and can tell uh, quality uh, from crap, uh, I tell you, the knives from Tops are absolutely uh, just, just, no pun intended, just top notch. But just look at the thickness of this knife. If you're going to do batoning or take on Arnold Schwarzenegger or whatever the hell that you uh, want a, a good, beefy, all-around uh, useful knife, uh, this one you will be very happy with. And it is extremely sharp out of the battle box. Like I said, if you go check out some other ones, obviously this is the this is the special color just for Battle Box, but be, being that they uh, ship it with uh, with an unfinished uh, micarta, it kind of gives you the ability to do what you want uh, with yours. You got your uh, pivot point for uh, your your uh, bow uh, style fire starter. Something else I've never tried. I've seen it done. I've seen a lot of blisters produced. You also have uh, a spot in the back for your uh, your fire fire starter. If you want to use uh, that as a uh, as your scraping tool. Tops knives, brothers of bushcraft and fieldcraft. This alone, they give it a hundred and. $49.99 value. So that's why I'm telling you guys, if you really like this knife and want to uh, get a hold of it, it's like buying this knife at regular price and then getting all of the rest of the stuff this month as a freebie. But like I always tell you guys, if, if I don't like something, I'm not going to tell you it's cool because I don't want to see someone waste their money on something. This knife, the Tops knives, I mean go to their site, go to go to Tops knives and check out the quality of their knives. And being that I added uh my own uh, little uh, little shade of a uh, color to it and then finish I have made it unique and I have made it my own. I would say the uh, low point is uh, the sheath that comes with the cub is uh, very, very nice. This one is just kind of your your standard uh, run of the mill. You know, you can uh, easily get the strap so you put it on molly webbing uh, on a belt. I mean, don't get me wrong. It's just that if, you, if you've seen the uh, sheath that comes with the uh, tops, uh, the cub, uh, they really go over overboard on that one. But okay, guys, that and that winds out uh, mission thirty-four from from Battle Box. Again, the thing that it's always about that that knife knife of the month club for me, and I think it speaks volumes that. Of the knives that I have in my collection, my three favorites have all come from Battle Box. So that's the BOB box. Bug Out Bag slash Best of Battle Box Mission 34, and uh, probably for the next year, the uh, starter. So if you are signing up for the first time, expect to see this box. Okay, guys, if you have any uh, questions, comments, please leave them below. And uh, since uh, YouTube likes to uh, do everything it can to make sure nobody finds uh, most of our videos anymore, please be sure to hit the, uh, hit the like button. Oh, that's right, I have it disconnected. <laughs> YouTube is useless. Please, share this. Check out the links below. 
uh, you, you won't be disappointed with uh, with BattleBox, and you definitely won't be disappointed with uh, any knife uh, from Tops. Okay, guys. Cheers. Oh, and something Wong? Of course it is. <laughs>